All right, Tiffany Williams back here at the Phoenix Field at the DCU Center with an incredible win tonight by the Massachusetts Pirates. But joining me right now is Thomas Owens. Just week after week, the consistency that you bring to this game. I mean, I, I, we were on the live up there broadcasting tonight, and I was like, the energy and just the consistency that you bring is amazing. From s season one that you were here to, or season two to now, how much does this mean to you? Um, it means a lot, you know. I put in, I put in, you know, the work, you know, um, day in and day out, you know, as you know, as a team, you know, we come in week by week, week by week, and try to get better. Especially this week. This week was, you know, it meant a little bit more to us this week, you know. So we came together as a team, and it showed, you know, on um on Saturday today. So connecting with a new with Wilson, the new quarterback. Mm -hmm. It's not Glass. It's not Alejandro Benefield. It's, it's it's a real big mix-up for you. So how did you feel into that? Um, Taz came in, you know, and did a great job. You know, Taz is a great player. You know, from Duke City game, you know, he came in and and bought into what we were trying to do. And um, with Duke City, you know, he only had I don't he didn't have any um, practice with us, practice um, days with us. This week, you know, we got a full week, and you know, the rhythm started getting a little bit better and. He came out of the nothing, got the job done. There was that one snap where it just went into his shoulder. How do you correct that stuff? Uh, well, it went into. It went like it, there was that one snap, and it just like the ball just went into his shoulder instead of. Oh, there was like yeah, a miscommunication yeah, on the snap. Um, basically, just miscommunication with him in the center. You know, mm -hmm. uh, he was basically telling one of the receivers to get on the line, but the center also heard go, so he snapped the ball. That was the only reason that happened. Okay, so. Coach Williams made a good uh, a good point. Mm -hmm. A lot of the mistakes, they're not physical mistakes, they're mental mistakes. Mm -hmm. So how do you change those around going under the bye week, but then you got to go back on the road? How do you change those around going on the road? Um, you know, going going into this bye week, you know, uh, hopefully, you know, the guys get some rest because we, uh, we really need it. But, you know, we get some rest, you know, come back, and we just dial back in, you know, and finish the season strong, you know. We got um, two falls in, what, two weeks? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, like I said again, Hopefully, you know, the guys enjoyed it. Their, um, their day is out, but once we come back, you know, it's, it's ready to go. we're ready to go. Your former teammate, J.D. Griggs, and I, at the beginning of the season, we were talking about who was going to come down to at the end of the season, and we said Frisco Fighters and the Massachusetts Pirates. You look at first place and second place right now, mm -hmm. it's kind of playing out that way. Mm -hmm. Are you guys ready for the Frisco Fighters? Um, we're not too much worried about Frisco right now. You know, we just, like I said again, you know, we're going we're gonna to take these days off, you know, that we have, and then we're going to move on to so far. So far. Thank you very much. Quick game.